We're going back to the roots of my channel for this one. Before I get this video started, I want to say thank you guys for 800 subscribers. You guys have been amazing. Um, it's been awesome to see myself go from like 30 something subscribers to like 800 in just like 10 months, less than a year. Um, and that's been pretty dope for me. Uh, you guys are really making my dreams come true. So I just want to thank you guys for that. And so now to the main point of this video, we are talking about Nikocado Avocado. Now, if you don't know who that is, let me just give you guys a clip of him real quick. This dude weighed in at like between 400 to 600 pounds. If you don't know what he does, he's a mukbang YouTuber. And today, today something big happened. He uploaded a video called Two Steps Ahead or something like that. He came into this video like riddle me this type shit and it was just mind blowing. This dude seven months ago was like 600 pounds now he's like who knows probably like 140 now at this point which is obviously really healthy and it was just crazy to see and the video it's just like he was kind of talking on menacingly too which is weird but that's besides the point this dude i don't know if it was in seven months this could have been in like a, a year or two in the videos he just had them lined up or something i don't know but it's just this guy lost so much weight and it was revealed i don't know how true this is it was revealed that this was a social experiment and it's like that almost adds up and i'm assuming the experiment like the whole social experiment idea was doing something so ridiculous to gain attraction on social media and it worked. He did something over the top. He ruined his body for years straight just for views and money and whatnot. And I, I kind of got to give it to him. It worked. This guy is probably a millionaire. He's made money off his OnlyFans. Uh, if y'all didn't know he had that, he had an OnlyFans. All he had to do was sit there in front of a camera for like however long and eat food. Now, how he did die from a heart attack, I don't know. It's, it's an absolute shock to me how he didn't die from a heart attack, but he's alive and he is healthy. Um, here's, here's a little picture of him right here. This is him now, uh, versus before. So it's just, it's insane because I, I was really like invested in this guy around the Oompaville, a uh, like whole like collab. And it was so weird. Cause you would see him break character. You would see like his actual person. like personality breakthrough and then it's like so wait obviously we all knew this was a character and now he's sitting here all menacingly in front of the camera and i don't know if that's his self or if that's like another character he's trying to play it's just it hurts your brain but overall this was a w i mean right now we got dr disrespect trying to come back and defend himself from being a pdf file um which i don't think he's ever gonna recover from and i believe he shouldn't and then you now you have nikocado avocado the world's one of the world's largest mukbangers on youtube not really but he was a large dude it, it's just insane to like think this is this came out of nowhere i don't think anyone expected this now everyone there was rumors going around that this guy was on like a weight loss journey and that's why he wasn't uploading for so long but the thing is, I think he wouldn't upload for long periods of time in the first place. People were suspicioning after he visited Oompaville that there was going to be like a weight loss journey. But this guy didn't even give us a journey. He just brought us to the end, to the finish line. And this dude's now skinnier than a fucking twig. It's just, it's insane, man. And you know what? I gotta give my respects. I gotta give my respects, man. I think everyone was waiting for this. And I think the whole the whole thing where people were like almost advocating for him becoming bigger like this and eating a bunch of food and being like, yeah, we like this. I think he wanted that. I think he wanted people to sit there and tell him, hey, keep doing what you're doing or cheering you on to like gain weight. I think people, he wanted people to do that. And it worked, it happened. I think that was the point of like the whole social experiment thing. And now he's like lost all this weight and everyone's just cheering on cheering him on more. People are saying how 
crazy of a turnaround this is it's like yeah people do this type of stuff all the time people will have their weight loss journeys but to see it like from someone like nick Akata, avocado someone you knew who was playing a character but we all assumed was messing his body up because he was just in a bad mental state it's a bit it's a bit of a mind fuck i'm not gonna lie just overall this has been a crazy situation today um i knew in like the first in the first 12 hours of this video being online it gathered like 5 million views and all the comments are just like people are like dude this is insane and it's like yeah i agree this is crazy let me know what you guys think about this whole situation i think it's pretty cool i think it's i'm i feel like i'm smelling like a <laughs> like an Oompaville video coming up. There's already a Moist Critical video out there, but I haven't watched it. But I know there's an Oompaville video coming up and I'm, I'm smelling it, you know? But overall, it was a crazy situation and I wanna know what you guys thought about all this. If you don't know who Nick Akato Avocado is, like I said, well, you kinda know now. So, with all of that being said, crazy situation. Um, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace. Hmm. I'm wondering if I should start doing commentary videos again. What do you think?